Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm going to be starting off the week with my very first thread up unboxing. If you're not familiar with ThreadUp, it's like a thrift store online basically and they do these goodie boxes where you can get, I believe it's 10 items per box and a stylist will pick the items off for you based off of your profile and just like things that you've requested for the box. I've been very interested in this box. In fact, my sisters have tried it out and they really like it. So I'm going to give this a try and I put down a $10 deposit for this box as the styling fee, but the $10 does go towards an item in your box. I prefer shopping on Poshmark for thrifted fashion because I just tend to find a lot more on there, but ThreadUp has some really nice stuff too. I just haven't personally bought anything from them yet, but hopefully I will have some fun stuff in this box. They do a whole referral link too, so I'll leave that down below if any of you are interested in trying this out too. This is a label with all of the price information. Oh, this is, um, how do I feel about that? This has like little pleats at the bottom of it and then it has the embroidered flowers. The neck has some really pretty ruffles on it. The retail is $90. Red up price is $17.99. I'm gonna go try it on and then I will be right back and we will keep going. favorite jeans that I wear with everything. I think this would look better if it was more of a crop style and then these frills like came up here. It's a little bit of a longer shirt. I don't think I like it as much just because of that. Otherwise I like everything about it. Like I love the embroidered flowers. I love the color but I don't think that the length is the most flattering for me. That is so pretty. It actually looks like it might be a little bit big on me though. This is from a brand called Significance. It is a size 12, but I mean, that is so pretty. It's a midi skirt. The established retail is $36. Um, the thread up price is $22.99. This one does look like it's been a little bit worn around the um, buttons, but everything is still on there. Yeah, I mean, this looks really nice. So I'm gonna go put this on, style it and see how this ends up turning out. Yeah, I'm, I really like this. Of course, I'm gonna like this with all the florals on it. turtleneck would look the best with this because it's so high-waisted but I do really like this look it is a little bit more fitted up here than I was thinking like it's pretty tight and then it's got like this material underneath that is a little bit like it feels a little bit weird but it's not uncomfortable so this is where it like snaps shut and then it does have like a little pocket so I really really think that I'm going to go ahead and keep this I mean I'm already really impressed as to how well the stylist listened to me. This is a one shoulder style. It's long sleeves and this feels like really good quality. The established retail is $49 and the thread up price is $20.99. So I do have plenty of black sweaters, but I really like this. It has like the ruffle along the collar line, but then it's like that one shoulder statement. Yeah, it feels very heavy. I am so impressed right now. I really have not been giving thread up the chance that it deserves. box and pull out some florals. So I pulled out this Madewell skirt. It has like a bow in the front, some ruffles, and then I paired it with these tiny boots from Nordstrom. I love how this top looks with this outfit. It does have like that extra ruffle right here. Aside from it being just slightly too big on me, I really do like this look. This is a top from Gap. 
It's a little bit more lightweight, so it's probably going to be a little bit difficult to wear this during this time of the year. I mean, I could layer it up with sweaters and it'd be fine, but it's very cute. I can tell it's been worn though. It is a little bit more of a worn item, but this is $60 and the thread up price is $16.99. It is sheer, but I'm not wearing anything underneath it except for a nude bra, and I feel like I can definitely get away with it. I do have something in my closet that is very similar to this. Um, so I just paired it with my high-waisted jeans from We The Free, and then these clogs are from Free People. I could see myself wearing this. This is so soft. And it has like the ruffles on the front. This is reminding me of that Target sweater that I got, but it has like floral patterns all over it. And it's not quite as big and bulky as that Target sweater is. The established retail for this sweater is $48, and I could get it for $19.99 from Thrift. this sweater as a crop style. I just kind of tucked it into these high-waisted mom jeans that I got from ASOS and then I paired it with these white boots that I got from a trunk club. And this sweater is definitely very wearable for me. I love the floral patterns on it. Um, let me just untuck it for you so you know where the length hits. Yeah, I feel like it falls at a really nice length. It's still very comfortable to tuck in. It's not like I have a bunch of material right here. I knew it. As soon as I saw it, I was like, this definitely has to be ASOS. This is a size 10. It has like those huge sleeves on there. It does have an open back. Lots of pleats on this dress. It is a little bit off for the season, but I mean, I wear this stuff during the fall and winter. I just throw a big sweater over it. The ASOS casual dress is $48. The thread up price is $27.99. It's a dress, so I'm gonna have a hard time saying no. As much as I love wearing dresses during the fall and winter, this one is a bit light, so we'll see. on Pinterest where one of the models wore like a black turtleneck underneath a dress very similar to this and I really liked the look. This fabric is a little bit lighter than I was thinking like it's not it doesn't feel like the best quality and the sleeves for some reason on this dress I feel like are not the most flattering on me. I don't think I'm gonna keep this dress though because I definitely am looking for more higher quality. This one feels like almost like a Shein dress. Ooh. A Ralph Lauren top. I feel like this might be a little bit big though. It has little birds and it's that very pleated style. So this actually is quite big. I'll give it a try because I really like this. This is $110 for established retail and thread up price is $24.99. I'm gonna go try it on. the top turned out with this mini skirt from Francesca's and it has the high collar that I I just love that look it's so elegant I do have one top that is very similar to this but it's red I don't know this one definitely looks and feels very worn I feel like this isn't quite the type of florals that I go for but I'm gonna give it a try established retail is $98 that is very surprising 
but then the thread up price is $17.99. So I, I feel like they really did bring that price down quite a bit since it does look pretty worn. But I'm gonna go style this and see what I can come up with. up with some different outfit ideas but I feel like this color combination is kind of hard to style so I just went for black and I mean I like the look but I like the other skirt better because this one just isn't quite my style and I don't think it's as flattering as the other one. I do like where it falls on me lengthwise. It does have elastic in the back which was really nice so this one was actually quite easy to get into and then let's see mm, I don't I think I like it. Um, this reminds me of high school. It has a stretchy waistband. I don't like the pattern. I am going to go try it on and see. This is $62 and the thread up price is $17.99. really liking this skirt. As far as it being my style though, I don't really see myself wearing this. I am definitely gonna be saying no to this, but I think it is really cute and I think some people could really pull it off. I'm not gonna hold this up too much in here because I feel like sometimes white can really blind you. So this has the most gorgeous sleeves. I have so much in my closet that is white though. I feel like I don't need this. It has the button down in the back and then it has a bow around the elbow. This blouse established retail is $107. And then the thread up price is $24.99. I know I'm gonna end up liking this shirt. I do not have anything like this. It's actually more of a crop style, so it fit really well with this jumpsuit. I can tell it is extremely high quality, and it does have the button-down style in the back, but I have plenty of room to work with. Definitely going to probably jump on this top. Just look at that. I love that. Overall, like, I had a really good experience. So I am going to try this again. I also wanted to mention that this box did take a long time to get here, but I overlooked that because of everything that is going on in the world right now. I'm really happy with what I got, but I just wanted to mention that in case that is something that would affect you. And yeah, I think that's everything.